Come on. Two. David, we billed those assholes two million last month. It's time we made partners. Marshall, Mr. Ambitious. We're coming up on six years. You don't remind me. So, why can I read that new draft? Tonight, I'm about to play tennis. <laughs> he really is trying to make partners. <laughs> it's no one from the office playing with a college friend. <laughs> the dude who went pro. That's him. <laughs> Kick some ass. Yeah, I'll try. Marshall, Philip, man, good to see you. Ah, <laughs> oh, am I late? How long you been here? You're good. Glad we can make this happen. Uh, we got court too. Meet me out there. Just gotta grab a couple talks. Sure. Uh, locker room's down the hall if you need. Warm up. Perfect. You still sponsored? I get the discounts. Three? I've only got time for a set. Lessons start at one and go through the afternoon. Of course. Set's more than good with me. Any time on court with you, man. So what are you up to? Um... You practicing for anything? Any tournaments on the horizon? Nothing on the radar. I'll be here for a while. You're in the city, right? I work in the city, yeah. Living in Brooklyn Heights. You? I commute from uh, the east side. Giving lessons there, too, at the River Club. Oh, nice place. Catch up more after this? Yeah, let's get to it. All right. Oh, hey, Phil, let's spin. Up or down? Down. What's up? All serve. First game, love all. Love. <laughs> My bad. It's all good. Fifteen all.
You know what I was thinking about the other day? Remember that time Coach Stein got a wild hair up his ass and he took us down to Jacksonville State? Remember that kid Kenny that played third seed? So he puts you against Kenny and uh, you, you've got to remember. Please stop. getting the rest of your stuff. Okay. You should come back. Please come back. So, you dating anyone? Not right now. I'm engaged. Yeah. This is my Yancey. Casey. Congratulations. Thanks. She works down at the DA's office. We met in law school. Oh, wow. Hey, Casey. Case. Look at this, look. Look. It's incredible, you see that? You see it? This was in 2014, right after you graduated. I'm gonna close the curtain. Yeah, okay. He lost to Nadal. 3-1. Like, he lost to Nadal in the second round of the Open. He got a set against Nadal. <laughs> it was his only Open, but still. Can you imagine playing against Nadal? Like, going in the ring against that Bull. That bull. Yeah. That bull. Yeah, like a matador and a bull. Are you gonna take a lesson with him? No. It's Philip. The guy I told you about. He's my teammate from college. Case. I mean. He looks good. Yeah. Okay. He played one for us. I mean, he was supposed to go pro after his sophomore year, but stuck around to win NCAAs. It must have been great to play with such talented people. Well, we didn't play as much back then. There was a division between the top and the rest of us. I mean, I was good. Am good. Am good. It just wasn't worth their time, you know? It was like gladiator training for them. That's sort of why I've reached out, you know? We haven't kept in touch, but why not see if he wants to hit? Can you imagine that life, though? As a pro? <sighs> Traveling the world, you know? Living out of a couple of bags, playing the best? I mean, Nadal. It's monastic, but it's all about the tennis, your game, and competition. No more. Bankruptcy proceedings, restructurings, just tennis. <laughs> you should leave the firm. Tomorrow, I get a chance against a legend. You're so weird. Well, shall we? 
Hey, don't give me anything, all right? Lobo. Let me have that. Love fifteen. He needs to look out for the temper, but he's playing really well. I'll see him next week. Sounds good. Okay. Fifteen forty. <laughs> Side. Bill, didn't see you on the books this morning, bro. Who's your guy? We're just hitting. He's an old teammate from college. Who'd you have this morning? Baby sat the Pearlstein kid. You looking tired? You want a coffee? You uh, need an Adderall? How's the Julia situation? She moved out yesterday. You okay? You know you can always give me a call. Philip is giving as good as he's getting. Nadal 15, seems stunned 30. by the newbie. A remarkable performance from the young American. What a shot! Philip Chacon is testing Nadal's medal on Arthur Ashe today. The defending champion is not enjoying himself out there. Uh, Skip, can you tell us a little bit about his opponent? He captained last year's Ohio State men's team, took them all the way to the finals, where they won their first national championship. Do you ever hold that trophy? Oh, wow. You just gotta rub it in, don't you? <laughs> Philip is How one hard are you away right now? from taking the first set. I'm just kidding. I'm just excited. I know. Ready. Brock. Marshall, nice to meet you. Good to meet you too. I um, just caught the end of your second game. Good oh. looking stuff. <laughs> Thanks. You two went to college together. Yeah, Ohio State. You're a pro here? Yeah, holding it down with this one. So I um, caught the legendary match last night. 
2014 U.S. Open. Round two. Oh, Jesus. Come on, <laughs> Come on man. What was it like to play in the doll? Uh, Crazy athlete? Genius athlete. <laughs> and? No chinks in his armor, man. Everything's effortless. Still, you played amazing that first set. Yeah, well, I was out of my mind. He was cold. Where are you playing nowadays, Marshall? Around Brooklyn, mostly. There's a league up in Fort Greene, but it's inconsistent. I've been playing a lot of golf with Casey, my fiance. Nice. Well, hey, we got a league going on here. Wednesday nights, a lot of you D1 guys show up. It's not exactly your neighborhood, but this one folds in occasionally. You should come on by. Sounds great. Speaking of, you ready to get to it? Let's do it. All right. Hey, nice to meet you, Brock. Yeah, likewise. Oh. Looks like you have a fan. <laughs> Hey, it's a lot more than can be said for some of us. Philip is one point away from taking the first set. Okay. Two games to zero. Love all. That's a good shot. Love 15. Come on. Do all. Yeah. Yeah. Nice, very nice. Eyes on the ball. Of 40. Fifteen forty. Damn it, sorry, Phil. Fucking, I fucking love that. <laughs> My God. My dude, I'm spent. I wish I could have given you more. Oh, good, Marsh. That was fun. Oh, fuck off. It's all lessons nowadays. I never get to play on weekends. <laughs> this was great, really. You're playing well. All against you, yeah. You know, you really should come play the league. There's good competition. Brock and I are always here. It sounds great. Mm. This is great. You get to play every day. I'm jealous. So I uh, saw a bar inside. 
You got time for a beer? Huh? Oh, I got some back-to-back -back lessons this afternoon. Better not. Of course. Another time, then. No big deal. What kind of law do you practice? Corporate restructuring. <laughs> Business law. You know, 80 hour weeks, it's relentless. I love it. So it's my MBA to use. Well, totally. We got plenty of lawyers playing here. Yeah, how much are lessons? With me or Brock? Uh, you. <laughs> 150 for an hour. Right now, I've got a five lesson package for 650. Super reasonable. Okay. Wait, wait, so I gotta know. You were on tour. You get laid before a big match? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Does it like affect your tennis? Sex never affected my tennis. Staying out all night trying to find sex affected my tennis.